Your feet are a foundation for movement and they are one of the best way to break in the foundational effectiveness of your yoga tune-up balls. Keep the therapy balls in their tote and place them on the ground. Stand next to a wall or a chair and then simply let your foot slide on top of both balls at once, going from toes to heel and back again. So I'm leaning body weight in, attempting to create a little bit of, of smush into the balls. The more the balls are rolled, the squishier and grippier they get, and your feet become texturized too. They just get smarter. Go ahead and switch sides. There are 26 bones in your feet. There's also 26 letters in the alphabet. And so by getting to move your feet bones, you start to literally speak the language of your body more clearly. So after a few up and downs, and by the way, if this feels heavenly, keep with it, but to get even some more specific muscles, bones, and soft tissues of the feet, you want to now reduce and go down to one ball. Now this can also be done with a slightly larger therapy ball plus, especially if you have larger feet. I'm a size six, so the yoga tuna ball is a perfect fit for me. The ball is going right into the center of the arch. And again, I can lean body weight into my other side if the pressure is too much. And then in slow motion, just going from side to side, trying to map the foot and introducing movement where movement may not be happening a lot, especially if you wear tight, restricted shoes. Then do the same thing on the ball of the foot. Let the toes hang and slowly roll from side to side crossing across through every ray of the foot, helping your toes and the midfoot bones to become more mobile. Then stand off and change sides. And already just on the other foot, you might feel that the foot in and of itself is broadening and might feel like it has more surface area. And that's a good thing. When we wear tight shoes or shoes with the heels that are raised, we actually diminish and lose our proprioception, our sense of knowing where our body is in space. And the foot is so important for the body to know where it should go in, for its next step, for its next direction, and how much pressure it can put into the ground. Then you go up to the ball of the foot and slowly rolling from side to side, taking the time to try to explore each of these 26 bones. Whenever you roll your feet, you improve your whole body's movement intelligence and that allows you to step with your best foot forward.